Well, let's see what they can bring. Round one already started up. Sentinel's having a look towards that A side. This is straight away the wall in place to prevent that cross into heaven, at least. Have to give some information away. Nookie going to be called upon here with the frenzy, actually. Ignores the dash, but 10 still finds the opening. Sentinels trying to carve their way into A site right now, and Mixwell left to do nothing but sit inside screens. Now the poison orb going to go up, and that's going to potentially give a lot more control over to Sentinels as the spike is planted. Let's see how much ground they can get. It's like the springboard back in. Shazam does not care for it. He's leaning forward, catches the CT push from Mixwell. As Dapper looking towards that playback through from the T side, that flank that will be coming in. We saw it slowly building with a Vover over that side, but he's got support, he's got Kellogg's here as well. But Sentinels, boys, they're a little One different, they just don't miss. This is clean! The only one to draw blood so far is a Vover, that's two. But there's an army in the way, this isn't gonna happen. 8 HP, the Dream's dead, Tens has got it, that's the first! Hey, but Spike leaning B side, and there's two members outside garages. here, so Cold Amenta will be called upon here, or at least Tommy Turret. We'll give that information away. Tens and sick. Ooh, information gone on the back of it. They will retrieve the orb. But elsewhere, again, there's two players creeping through mid as well. Yeah, that's been catching my eye. And look at all the attention. G2's putting it this way. They're about to get crunched on this. Coral Colomenta. Very unfavorable scenario for him as Sentinels. Lovely start, very clean. And I want to see how they fare in these anti-ecos, I guess you could say. I mean, we have a shorty and a sheriff, not much else. This should be five alive. If you're looking at Sentinels as expectations, I mean, most of us, if we're being reasonable, probably chose between maybe Gambit, if you're more of an EMEA fan, NA, looking at Sentinels here. And if you're a bit weird like me, I go 100 Thieves. But these boys are the real deal. And as you can see, so far, five standing. And Kelox is your last one there. Spike planted. Not going to get any bonuses there at all. Prime gaming flawless. Second round. Sentinels looking. But Sentinels spread across as well. Kellogg's going to be called upon so in a minute. OK, gets out. Might play in Nookie a little. He didn't quite get the pickup he wanted. And damage not quite being done until then. Cold Amenta going to draw blood over by Mailroom. And they are actually greeting the challenge in towards middle. Keeping them just at arm's length. Maybe just far enough for those rifles to ring through. But bear in mind, statistically speaking, and just by every account statistically, and any way you want to look at this, G2 should be able to convert this round. But those SMGs, when brought up nice and close, if they can keep pressuring mid, can still do damage. Now, again, this pressure is between Nuki and Kellux. Yeah, Kellogg's actually backed all the way away from this, and <laughs> Six still forcing his way in here. Actually getting way, way closer. Over has to be called upon for a gravity well there. And Sentinel's closing the distance here. It's going to be really difficult. Is Kellogg's dangerous. down to 2 HP. Yeah, this is good, though. Nice aim from him, but now he's under severe scrutiny. He's going to be eventually bound of over. He's got his back, though, and this is good trading. Dapper great work. Big damage. What's the pressure CT? Why not get in there? Get in their faces! Nookie. He's on a site for G2. Very careful here. Again, the Viper wall up. Sick actually opens up straight away onto Kellogg's. Look, you, you can get away with that against others, but the aim on the Sentinel side is just unrelenting. Mixwell's going to have to deal with this as well now. Tens on the other side. He knows what's around that corner, but he's got Nookie by his side, so it's not so bad just yet. Actually, he even gets to back away. Lovely utility work, but does he dare double down? Nookie wants it, sticks around for it. This isn't bad, but this is still such a bloody battle as Sick wins that final fight, and now suddenly the site is open, ready for the taking of 3v2. And there's going to be the ult to just allow that ferrying of the spike across safely. Oh yeah, it's going to be a comfortable plant inside the Viper's pit. Rover and Cold Amenta. Really, really difficult for them to break through here, especially with the Zom's position so deep. Actually gives them a pocket just behind right on site, really, to play from. The wall as well across elbow. Uh, this is a tough this retake for them. Grenade. Oh, you think about the utility that's just been flooded in. They can just sit the time ticking so favorably towards Sentinels. Over shows where he is now. Falls attention, but shows that he's also off it. Dips away, but that allows Cold Amenta. Find a bit of space towards Dapper, but bear in mind there is one player who is the safety net, but that is going to be Zoms. Has to give away position, but he will get him over. That's exactly what the doctor ordered as Zoms. This round again, G2 have a couple of bits and pieces. Mixwell and Nookie. Getting the Spectres, a couple of Sheriffs to supplement, but it's very light in comparison, of course, to Sentinels, who are sitting quite flush. Shaz on the Spectre, the rest all locked and loaded, but maybe feeling out what they're coming up against. No real rush on this one yet. Yes, the wall's invested and Tens showing a little leg, but it's not too much to worry about just yet. 
58 seconds, there's the first contact. Sick with a comfortable opening, looking like they want to get towards B now. Take that space that's been given and allow Tens that freedom to roam a little further forward, clear the site, and you can already see those defensive lines are starting to build up around this site. Dapper, oh, good awareness by Kellogg's, at least of the possibility. Cold are actually good for the trade. One weapon retrieved at least in mid, but how much more they can do in this round. Sentinels with a man advantage and <laughs> It's tough to break through here with two SMGs. Colomenta no can't even get out of that smoke, actually. Sick. For a moment, glanced away, and actually Colomenta finds one. Yeah, but it's instantly traded. That's the beauty there of Tens coming around. But it is going to be found again by Nookie. So there's a bit of a back and forth there, but Mixwell. Played Storm off the rip here. Kellogg's actually with the operator online. He's over towards B main here. Nookie invests the showstopper, but nothing on the other side of it. That's a lot of utility getting sent out here by Nookie just to try and slow down this push or try and regain some control. Nice. Actually, Nookie. Tens will find two there. Tens and Zom's fall. Down. Yeah, that's so well done by Nookie. Finally taking a little bit of, I, I guess, proactive play towards middle, even though he's been pretty much dictated to by that man. Even just the audio cue forced his hand earlier on. And now Shazam is not done yet. He still has to do some more because Dapper just got caught off trying to play up towards A. Can Shaz do something miraculous here? Knives out. It's time to go. Has to find the player just around that corner. He knows what he's got to do. And no, it's not worked out well. Coldementer, lovely. He'll do at least get a little bit of ground gain towards that A site. But Coldementer still just happy to sit back. Spam away. Not too many worries just yet. How much room is Shaz going to be given here? That's what makes me nervous. This is, this is what I'm talking about. Kellogg's being in position with the operator to greet kind of, the, you know, the other side of this plate. And that's on the back of that contact on A, right? So absolutely can't fault Zoms for trying to find something no. in there. But that's what I'm looking for for G2, is remaining composed, keeping that structure and formation on the defensive half. They could overwhelm here so easily, though. <laughs> yeah, there it is. That's the problem. There it is, oh, Tens! my word. Welcome to NA Valorant, boys. It hits different out here. That's an op now gone. They've got the site to themselves. Keep in mind, Shaz was holding that rotation, too. They're going to be so aware of where people are. Shaz can now get that spike blonde. They're going to be getting the res back up. It's all five standing now against three. And this is just panic stations. Oh, look at this play coming out. Dapper is just a rock for this side. And you had no right getting this round, but it looks like it's theirs unless Coldementa wants to clutch this one out. A 1v3 now presented. And he's got to get this done, but it ain't easy. And it's not going to happen. Da G2 now have to prove to us that they're able to innovate and adapt on the fly because Sentinels are one of the quickest to pivot one way or the other. And again, all credit to Shazam on that front in terms of the in-game leadership. But take a look at this round now. Sentinels much slower in approach. Three over towards A main here. Spike... Sat comfortably with Zoms and Kellogg's with a blade storm, actually. Not given anything. Sentinels are anticipating. CP pushing forward, making the most of this lesser purchase, but Kellogg's will be forced back. Now Shazam creeping ever closer towards Nookie. Might get caught there, actually. Damn, a, a rare miss from him. Well, uncharacteristic, but Tens has still been let off the leash. Shaz still watching for that re-aggress, catches it too. Nookie. Sentinels are just too aware of this, and Tens has fallen. Can't complement it comfortably. This is this is looking like they're trying to find those little gaps in the approach, and they're just not being presented. Shazam's like, well, I've seen what you're up to. I get the idea, but <laughs> it's not happening here, boys. A 4v1 of over and a Spectre. <laughs> I mean, I've over no real left. option but to try Spike and find an exit here, but expect Sentinels to be in place to greet him wherever he decides to show his face. Even really tested on the way in there. And again, this is, this is the immediate response based on Kellogg's obviously creeping a little further down mid. That information is relayed by Zoms and, and right away they're positioned. Zero will find Tente and an upgrade for himself, but Zoms will probably want to remove this from him. I don't know how strong the economy is right now for Sentinels. I didn't actually take note of that. So I wonder how much they're willing to chase this down and get it out of his hands. I see two of them already exiting, getting far away, so they should be safe enough, maybe just leaving one to chase. And actually, yeah. Evova's just fine. So yeah, no no real threats beyond that. Rifle should be kept on either side. Oh, this is Bursty as well. Hold on, this is going to be real pacey. Tens, man! Who needs any further flashes when you've got him and that Leer sick? 
has his back, but it's a over to isolate the first. Capitalizes on the second, and it ain't over yet. G2 still holding strong, but Shazam is the only one to find success, and that's in middle. So now look what remains. Shazam and Dapper. And if G2, if you fumble this one, you're going to be in the bin for it. But Dapper's going to take the time to maybe investigate a little deeper. Say, Shaz, hold on, give me a sec. I'm, I'm going to work. Let me get some work done. Because keep in mind, I don't think Kellogg's is going to be considering this for a second or two. There's going to oh, be that is. internal clock. Wow, he's actually already thinking about it. Dapper. Yeah, well done, Kellogg's. Great decision making there. And wow. G2. Actually hold it down. I saw a world there where Sentinels were about to slice them apart. Uh, Mitchell, are you trying to find an angle on that? This is just pixels apart here. The spree, it's not beautiful, but it does find intended targets. Shaz, though, this man's on a mission. Take down Heaven Control. Can't quite get it that time, though. Nookie, once again, steadfast, holds Heaven. Look at that spike. Yeah, uh, um, my eyes go straight mm. towards him over here. Obviously, Sick does have that wall to get himself safe passage. And that's it, the Cosmic Divide gonna come up as well. Just to make absolutely sure elsewhere, Nookie will find tens, but again, it's just to allow Sick and Zom's access to B-Site here. Revolver tucked up behind and Golem enter in hell. Now a 2v4, Spike ultimates planted. available for G2 as well. Got plenty to work with here. Placing sentry. Now we wait patiently for that playback through. They're already quite close here, G2, just around this corner. Sick and Zoms. One back sight, one towards main. The first challenge. It falls, no trade. Kellogg's is going to go down. There's nothing more. It's Nookie. Sick with the Spectre here. Again, Sentinel's going to focus their efforts towards mid. And that's it. Nobody even hold this. Nookie's going to be called upon here, but Sick actually finds the opener here. Bombs from G2's got to be fast. There's only two more. Players here to defend. Make sure I actually listen that orb onto how I expect that was the, the intended. What's down available? That's in, yeah, there's only one member towards B main here. The alarm bot's going to spot that out if Dapper decides to push on through. Sentinels now, they found a kill. Yeah, Trying to spread the Look at Kellogg's though. I'm waiting to see if Shazam can start exploiting any rotations as well. Just talk about the ult coming through there. That'll be kill Joe popping theirs down. I'm overlooking to. We open up an avenue of keeping control if needed. Capitalize on this. Time bought. Res came in. A lot invested into this round, though, considering Tenz has got the upgrade now. You've got Nookie just with the showstopper. No main weapon. And he's going to get absolutely ripped apart there. Shazam finds the opener. Mixwell will trade it out. Sensor will look to pile on the pressure. Yeah, they do. Mixwell isn't alone here. Cold Avenger apparently had his back. What is Sentinels doing? How are they converting some of these rounds, potentially? The three now left. Not Great really, work from Zombs. He didn't expect the follow-up from Avova. Now a 3v2. Up in the hands of Kellogg's and Avova with the rifle. But the site is completely under wraps by Sentinels. Post-plant now. Two rifles collected, put yeah. into the hands of Tens. Dapper, sick, all just fine. Tens going to put himself as the tip of the spear to swing if needed. As Kellogg starts to... Maybe have a little look around. Size 4A into this of over. Just starting to lean through. And 10's caught one. And now Kellogg's, yeah, run as much as you might. They're not going to let you leave. Sentinels! As we wait and see what happens here. We'll try and actually get a ramp. Takes a lot of damage on the back of the snake bite. A bit of spam through that poison orb as well. But three members of G2 hit against Spike. Just completely the other way. This is an attempt for Sentinels to pull rotations, and it's working perfectly. Shazam swings out once again. Has to retreat though. Even now it's just one man. It's a Vova in position to Here try comes. and hold down B. As soon as this hit doesn't come through, I want to see G2 moving, but look at them. They're stuck. They're all trying to they're, they're trying to control A site when, when there's nothing there. It's the wall for Dapper that's keeping them. All right, Avova, what have you got for us? You have every player coming your way. You are in danger. You are under threat. And you're dead. Shazam. He doesn't need to see you to find you. He puts him to bed. This is him good nine. Says, <laughs> see you in the next half. But three now stand. Coldamenta, Nookie, Mixwell. Spike now planted. And they have the way to work back in. They have so little information on this side of the map as well. Playing back in from that A side. Shazam, happy to look towards heaven as well. Look for that drop down from rafters. Cordamenta is up there. And it'll be sick. Get the first option to follow up. It's going to be ten supporting him. And now just old Nuki, and they know where he is and they're going to start hunting him down. Nuki though, denies for now. But time high pocket, starting to dwindle down. He's got three more to find. This feels almost impossible. It, it is absolutely impossible here. Nuki has to find another one before the way in, but Zoms 
will stop that from happening. Sentinels will close out 8-4 on the half and Switching nothing sides. short of clinical in my eyes. Again, those two thrifty rounds stick out in my mind where... To four, Sentinels very much in the lead, but now it's the turn of G2 to breathe the aggressors. And speaking of, Kellogg's first man forward, joined by Nookie, takes out sick and it's quick. He's going to keep on going forward and Zom's back of sight. Oh my Somehow God. manhandles two, down, the third, eight. not too far for him. But the sight just precariously in control. Kellogg's, it wasn't pretty, but he gets the job done. That's three for him this round, and now a 3v2. Dapper and Shazam. And Shaz has found a little bit of timing to this. Got ahead of him. Hold over. on. Shazam, if he can find it on his own. That spike plant now denied. Avova catches the rotation. And now the fight is going to be no between way. Shazam and Avova. Shazam, you're a nasty, nasty player right now. In the 1v1. Kellogg's has already found three. And it's to save it. Shazam! You need some results to have a rivalry. And right now at 9-4 to four after that pistol. Uphill time now. G2 just being put in the blender. Shaz wants to free farm. Get those knives coming out nice and early. And he's gonna do it again. Flo the top by ramp, still with spectres. This is the bonus. And it's already got a kill. That's lovely work from him. Couldn't convert on a second. That's a little bit out of reach, but already a trade effectively is not bad. Ten still posted, and Sentinel's actually able to lean away from this now. Dapper gonna be called upon. I think maybe just spotting actually on that jump. He did actually, yeah. Kellogg's gonna walk right through the snake by both of them, but Mixwell will close down the kill. They have control of B site now. Look how quickly the flank comes through, though. Coldament is still posted outside A main. No information here. He's effectively lost in this lurk right now. Sentinels could find a straight 3v3 if they're quick about this retake. See it. Tens quickly on it. Gets the tag, not the frag. Sick, though, you follows up one. well. That's over now gone. 3v2. And now a double stack towards that CT side is going to make it tricky for Shaz to find a clean That's entry. Yeah, standing. it's not going to happen. Mixwell, good catch on that. Sick has got himself an upgrade here. Brilliant. So that's one. And Kelt is now on red alert. A little worried, but Coldament has got his back. There it is, G2. Keep. And this can only go on for so long. They don't have much to catch any flanks. They don't have a default. This has a time limit on it, and they're going to have to go soon enough. And it's going to be right about now. Kellogg's on in. Nookie to follow him. Mixed one not far behind. The site is going to be theirs. This is postured for a retake almost instantaneously, but Dapper down a little ahead of the spike plant, so it's not too bad. Six aim is sharp today. Kellogg's feels the brunt of it is we really have Nookie go and walkabouts, but the problem is you got Zoms ready and waiting. They're reading you like a book. They're about to close this chapter if you don't pick up the pace. Look at this. Sick just walks back in. This is my no sight. Get out. 11 to 5. Seeing a, obviously a weaker purchase. One rifle, the hero rifle on Cold Amenta. Shazam. Oh, oh, God. They line up. Don't make him just ring the bell. That's two easy frags. Make it a third. He's put it on a show. Make it so easy. It looks so comfortable. And the last two. Not really a threat right now. Luke is still bottom mid, Sheriff in hand. Paint's still available, but <laughs> again, at this point, there's no real value in doing any damage to the economy of Sentinels. Yeah. Spam comes through from Shazam. Colomit will find one, but you know, don't expect Sentinels now to be over-peaking on this. Oh, just swap the barrel there. Yeah, another freebie. Man. The fourth for Shazam. Is he good for the ace? A little eco farm just to close things out. There, there it is. Goes. Is on the horizon after this. That would be G2's pick. But right now, Sentinels have sent more than a message. They want to create that dynasty they were talking about. This would be a good first step. Clean start in the groups. All opening nade tends. It's going to be suffering off the back, but doesn't really yield. Has to be forced to kneel by Cold Amenta. And the space gets taken, or does it? Shazam waiting, always so patient. But the flank coming out from Kellogg's could be good, but the timing's even better for Shaz. There's the trade, though. Nookie's got him. Puts him back. Zom's back sight now. He's got four players coming his way. One left, one right, one up top. They're just about everywhere, and he can't deal with all those angles. Too many to find as Dapper. Your last one, a little further out. You ever heard the story of the 1v5? I, I don't think I want to. I've, nah. I've seen enough already. You've seen enough? All right. Well. Dapper, going to give it his best shot. No reason not to. Up through those vents, but he's being watched. Kellogg's eyes trained on it. Every single round. Yeah, nice Every shot. single Yo. round. Yo, nice shot, nice bro. Shot. Yo, nice shot. Nice, nice shot, bro. Stop cool. <laughs> <laughs> just completely unfazed. Oh, it just doesn't oh, make no, you feel no, good. No. And that star is going to be making Chaz smile. Like the Cheshire Cat already. Two big stars. Zom's like, well, look, we let you have a nice couple of rounds. James feeling that? good. We're going to shut it down. Not even entertaining it. 
We'll give up the space initially. Sick in position as well. Nuki Lovely. on the other side here. We'll find Shazam and Ten's there also. Yeah, this is potentially tradable on the A site, but we have to look towards the actual site hit that is starting to come on through. So this is going to be start building up. Tens has found Nuki. So there was that trade over towards A, but the spike is going to be going down on the other side. So that's now planted Kellogg's. Can he slip just behind enemy lines? No, but he can find a... <laughs> well, I thought it was a decent fight, but Zoms is still fighting the good fight for Sentinels. It's a 3v3 post plant, and G2 aren't in bad spots here. Mixwell, Cold Amenta, and Avova still standing, and Mixwell wants to retake that space towards that yellow. Maybe see if anyone's going to slip on through. He's seen enough. That's just a little too much shown. And Mixwell, this is the Mixwell you need to start seeing if you're a G2 fan. There he is. As well, Sheriff just tucked away. Light armor as well. There's a follow up peak, but it's Nookie well and truly aware. So he catches Shazam, and he knows there may be more. The timing might be just tickling away at the back of his brain, but look at this. Spike's on the way, and he's going to fall away from that. This is all going to be G2s. There is a player deep, but they wouldn't be able to deny the spike plan at this point. Well, initially, looking pretty good for G2. No pressure comes through. Nookie's still out here again. To get a little information on the back of his boom bot, but everybody from Sentinels already making their way towards B. Zom's already up on side. Ten's actually going to try and make his way back from Snowman. And see, the counter wall comes up. We'll create a little pocket. Look, he will find sick in transition. So, we'll respond as well on site. Yeah, and just a couple more to deal with, actually. Dapper and Ryan underneath. He might find a constellation. Thank God for that one. Yep, 22 HP now. Revealing area. What, he's is he just making sure he got the kill just, there? Uh, the That's... recon bolt is just to make sure nobody else is up there on No, you're two. right. There um, could have been we... another player there. Yeah. Spopping slowly. Does Nookie even consider this possibility? It doesn't look like he has. This looks like a murder scene. Oh, he's heard all the devs here. Tens is in the prime position. Sees one. Actually falls away. A. Does now say as well. Some boombot comes in and calls him enter. It's a big trade. Great trade in. This a mix one is right up mid. Catching sick and now this is getting a bit of a problem. Shaz is on an island. The other two players for Sentinels are not here. But Shazam... Ice cold, waiting patiently, and has to play this out to perfection. Can't do it. Kellogg's has got his number, and there it is. Sight's now open for business, and this can be a huge round for G2 to convert here in the bonus. Dapper and Zoms. Here. Trying to get something done on the way back Ooh. in. Kellogg's will actually fall. A little overzealous there, trying to... Spike planted. Hold up to control Player there, but Cold meant to trade it back out. Nookie follows up. Zoms will fall. G2 go three up. But he still has two of arguably the best brains, the best aims to handle on the other side. And there's the brain removed from one. Shaz is gone. The wrists still in place for tens, but he's going to have to deal with that and back away. On the other side, however, Zoms getting ready sick. Has he been played in on this, though? Do they know this? Do they check on it? How much can he do with it? Next well, catching Dapper. And for now, player advantage to G2. And they want to keep it that way. They've got the rifles, and this can get very scary. But look at this position. This is nastiness, Nookie. So the angles are clear. Oh, the first wasn't clean enough for their tens. And again, step by step, they're clearing this out methodically. Oh, let's see. Once again, cautious in their approach. Sick. Really up towards rafters. And D2 not overstepping the mark. Methodically clear through here. Nookie actually still catches sight of Sick ahead of time. Actually, some more damage comes Players through. And Nookie will find the kill. Nice. Third on the round now. Left. Spike will go down. Fantastic work from G2 there. And that's the sort of round that we were concerned about from map one, right? Lauren, uh, again. This could be something that they've maybe identified, that if they can tame Sentinel's ability to take this deep space, which they're still vying for. Shazno on the off, though, is going to be the difference maker. Going to get it, but there's a trade. No! Gets out with his life. Ten still posted up in position. Tries to fall away off the back of the Leer and leaves Dapper in a little bit of a corner. Nookie pries him out of it. G2 still on the move here. 4v4. How much more can they pressure this? Shaz on the back lines and Tens. He's just waiting around this corner. Shaz is watching this. Just eagle eyes from up above. Tens gets aggressive. <laughs> Rings the bell. Binds two. Nookie and Avova gone as Mixwell now. A 1v4 beckoning. And it ain't happening. Sick with a good closer. Set. So I was probably going to try this double updraft here to deal with Zom. That actually did get revealed there. Here we go. It does go up. Catch it. No, Shazam! We'll find Cold Amenta actually on that B lane peak. He's everywhere. He just shown presence to A that prior round. Now he's over here. Keeping himself very viable, but Zom's gets picked off. And that's going to force Shazam in a bad position. Okay. Mixwell's pressure through mid. Oh now God. catches that rotation, that fallback, but sick now on the site. He needs to live up to that name. 
keep control of this. Support's on the way. They've re-garnered that space in middle. Tens is the one there. Who needs knives when you've got a rifle like that? Tens happy to fall back now. He's done his job. But now G2, where do they take this? Tens already hightailing it over. Actually going to get himself into a position on barrel, so... G2 have to be disciplined. To be diligent on the way in here, because... Again, Tenzi will always put himself in this one-and-done spot. That dismiss. And the Vover actually kind of solo pushing right now. Off angles and Tens. Yeah, uh, too sounds, easy. sounds about Five right for a disaster. Tens going to readjust now. Still pressure comes in. Nuki on the flyby. Hey. Going to put it down. It's still a 2v2 here. Keep in mind, Coldementer has his ult. Nuki. I mean, he's just got a gun and that's normally enough. He's been pulling off 1v2s, but look at this retake positioning from Sentinels. Right around the back and actually Dapper's quite far ahead here. He's made some good progress. And timing is everything. Coldementa hasn't considered it until now. Dapper is right next to him. Clears the right side. He's on the left. Coldementa holds him back as sick. The next step forward finds him and now it's a 1v1. Nuki has been god tier over on this side of the map. But Sick's a bit of a legend himself. Taps the spike, falls away, looks for that pixel out of place, looks for Nuki, and Nuki finds him! Maybe this is a reason why. Labored from both sides. It's a little weird, but it will be Shaz to find Mixwell. So mid's now open and eyes now removed from watching maybe a push up. And it looks like a stack's already coming out here. They're well aware. Deeper wall as well. Very interesting to see that one up here. G2 falling slowly away from this. I think the Viper's bit. Definitely going to oh, make them Shaz. reconsider Shazam. That's actually got the cutoff on this rotation as if well. He, if they try and step across this, it's such a hard angle to clear. He could be getting away with being the guillotine in this. Three players around this corner. That's one. It's only one. A second's down, difference in Coldementer. May have gotten that kill, but he's quick. And now it's a 4v3. Coldementer, Nookie, and Kellogg's. The death ball now going roaming. Take flight. Again, res available. I'm not sure actually how feasible it is with Shazam dying on top of tube. So you can see G2 actually pausing for a moment here. And whether or not the awareness is that Sentinels potentially try and get that back. Oh, I like this. If they catch some rotations here, you're going to have... 30 what? seconds left. Sova. Sova can just keep drawing their attention over towards A, right? Make a bit of noise. See if maybe they can catch some of these players. But you can see that intuition. Maybe making them question this. And there it is. Already going to find Spike the bigger. Down, Nookie's now gone down. Do they expect a second kill? Oh, it's good. Spray adjust. But the trades are so effective here for Sentinels. They've kept themselves in the right positions. Ten and what does Coldementer get to do with this? Spikes deep in enemy territory. Six seconds left. Have a little go for it. Not going to happen. Well done to Sentinels. Kept composure there. Kept it. And I'm just fury right off the rip. Now... I don't know if they actually did get a tag. It doesn't matter. It set tens into motion. Maybe able to get a little closer off the back of the audio cues, knowing that you can push a little bit deeper as they're going to be having to respect that. And he's already made great work of it. Finding Nuki is the perfect target to pick up. Especially with the work he's been doing towards belt on eight. No res available, so G2 yeah. will proceed as four. Shazam and tens on the other side of this once again. And look at the focus towards mid, actually. Aldor, I'm going to come through. I don't know, it will spot Tens actually up in. tucked up on second level of sight. There's a risk of being wallbanked here, but nothing comes through. No, he's still fine. He's still alive. He's got Dapper kind of having his back here. Wall goes in. Wants to at least give himself a chance at a gap here, but he's been chipped away at. Now Dapper. Going to pick up that mantle. Good damage towards Kellogg's, but he does manage to keep his life. Ten still living in the depths here. Unable to quite pop into this, and there's the ult coming out as a response. G2, fantastic control on site, actually. Brilliant. Uh, big swing and a miss. Avova will get the better of him there. And Avova finds a second as well. Sick will fall. Yeah, now the last three, where are they at? We've got a couple, or at least one, coming around on the flank. That's Shazam. Goldimenta up in towards Nest. It's Kellogg's to find 10, so now down to just two. Zom's down noted. Now spots it, does get Kellogg's. But in the meantime, Shaz lost life, and it will be an unfavorable situation for Zom's. And they're going to have to suck it up. G2 are right back into this. That's going to be six to two on the board, Hypog. Have we actually got a game on our hands now? I mean, it's looking that way. This is a fantastic start from G2, and looking so much better equipped, way more compact. Hopefully, they can't get us all right, whether it be Tens or Shazam on the other end. But let's see. Look, you're going to send the paint shell across the back. Kellogg's getting very deep towards server here. <laughs> Shazam will fall, actually. Dapper tagged up by that owl drone. It'll be a comfortable plant here. 
Not an awful lot really for Sentinels to get back in there. That's in the recon bolt. We'll got... find two tanks. Yeah, it was actually really well done, but bear in mind. The weaponry that came in with Sentinels was limited. Ten still going to do some work, though. 35 HP was on. Back on up, still sitting pretty now. A 1v3 beckons. It's not going to happen. Cold Dementor denies and G2. I'm wondering if Mixol's there purely off the back of the success that maybe they had off Shaz or someone pushing up mid. This is an interesting little read from him. Nookie showing. I'm still here. You have no idea where we're heading. But this is great. Again, just giving that away. Dennis up on the platter. Nookie's happy to face that Aldo and to give away that information. So Sam actually misses the first sign, finds the second. But look, Nookie's so commanding right now. He's he's keeping three players from Sentinels locked onto a site. of over does have the res. You will try and get this. Back up. Yeah, we'll just be behind the wall. Shazam can't punish that. Where's that mid luck? It's Mixwell who's looking to maybe left. crack this open. If he can catch the two players rotating, oh, that would no, be look perfect. At this. Let's see what Mixwell can do no, here, though. He has to catch this one. There it is. Great work from him. And now the other three from Sentinels are on an island, but it is three, and one of them is tens. Might be one of the best in the world, just on the other side of this. And there he is waiting, dapper by his side. Spike Guns locked and loaded. Again. Ten seconds. It looks like G2 have run out of time, run out of options. <laughs> Good idea someone's close by. Reads it. Shaz. So dangerous between the two of them. You can see the cogs turning there for Nuki. It's like a boom boss. Seen something. It's seen something close. <laughs> Kellogg's this time looking to punish. He peeks a little deeper, but it's actually Mixwell being caught in mid is the first blood drawn. Six going to catch that as Kellogg's is now going to at least take that long control. After maybe noting that Shaz is over somewhere else towards A, they can actually build up on this, but still no easy way through. Nuki this time now, starting to work towards middle himself. There. Okay, stop behind this. All for the time being. G2 not going to wait on that to come down, actually. And Zoms will find the spike carrier. Kellogg's unable to trade initially and will get revealed by the recon bolt. So has to back away the spike in control of Sentinels here. right now. That's the big one again. Now more time. Last time the frag came in through middle so late. Oh, no. oh that's a bit uncomfortable. Maybe could have done more with that. And now he's feeling a little silly, but can he still make it work? Yeah, it looks good. Nuki does find Dapper, but now it's just going to be Nuki. Oh, my word. Two more, though, Nuki. Do you still have it in you? Res comes in. He can't get it done. Ten. Ends. Not Look pretty. Mixwell on the only rifle here. Oh dear. Here we go. Nurki. Oh, oh, no no he's just leapt into the arms and he's got the frag onto Shaz. But where's the rest? There they are. Kellogg's picks up the pace just as Nurki left off. And it's a 4v3. Dapper's sick and Zombs are baffled. Scratching their head. Sick can't quite adjust the spray well enough on the second. And now two stand. Dapper and Zombs fired up trying to get that wall down for a quick bit of vision. But no one falls Fight foul play. instantly. Zoms finds the first. Kellogg's. Oh, no way. Zoms is nasty right now. And the 1v1. Coldementa, eight bullets. Zoms on the other side. Coldementa. He sees him. He gets him. It's G2. This time around, Sentinels now need to show what they're like in the driving seat here. Kellogg's. Real wide away. on that angle, but he does manage to make it out. That should be, though, Spike. Make yourself towards the side. Avova is straight down mid though. He's going to find this 1v1 with Zoms and actually Zoms going to win it. That's a big one. Kellogg's actually going to try and follow up on this. You can see though, Zoms still wise to it. He finds a second now. All this control. G2 have to force their way onto the side. Yeah, and no one's letting that happen. Shaz is still looking for those angles and it's mixed well. 1v5, not going to happen. A knife oh, comes out. Okay. Oh, read intuition. Okay, out very nicely. Maxwell is still close enough to call them over, but they'll be so far ahead now. The site should be theirs. Looking for a clean round hit. No Sentinels. And G2, of course, looking to do whatever damage they can. They can take a couple of weapons away, do a bit of work. That'd be brilliant, but you can see them kind of fight up here. Tens and Shaz in the shutdown, and it's just Mixwell. It's a flawless round as well to boot. It's a prime gaming flawless round. G2. Yeah, big job here. Not an easy one. Utility already coming through. Now he could actually rain death from a... Oh, no. Oh, no. The timing. The timing. How oh, is he alive? He's not for much longer. 24 HP just about makes out. And they want to capitalize. Look at them hounding him down straight in on that one. And the full up. Tens just runs down Cold Dementor 2. This is problems now for G2. This is where they're clutching at straws. You're not Fight feeling it now. It. Rifles left by the side. Nuki, though, picks up the pace and the pieces as Tens goes down. But the spike is planted. 3v3, Nuki. The top site here, but and Zom's controlling B main and in a position actually to use these snake bites. The lineup set up sick, just needs to buy a little time oh. here, a little bit of chip damage done, but the wall goes up. 
They're able to negate that Zoms. straight away. Zoms finds one with a snake fight. Shazam finds the last. Nuki is gonna fall away from this one. Call the Mentor still trying to work on something. Less to lose, I guess, in that regard. Right the tag. And actually, the re-aggress from Nuki. Well, it's interesting. Three bits of utility shown here. So actually, three members of G2 I'll accounted for here in the early round. And now the take on the space. Nuki is up top and loses the fight. Sick. Gets him, and there it is. Cracking open. That's all theirs. And the rest of the map becomes not necessarily irrelevant, but very far from the point. That spike can be ferried on over really easily now. Well, we've got to respect the wall here. That's the Dapper looking for damage in between. Kellogg's actually finds him. Spike planted. Swing out here. Sick low HP, but actually, yeah, Vova picks up the one up actually. It's just the rest though. You just don't see them making standing. errors, and of course, Ten's just sitting on an angle like that. Makes sure there's no chance in hell. Sentinels, 8-8. Eight, eight. Galax does have the op out in play, so that's something that could be different, and that is it! <laughs> Finds it there. The wall comes up, actually, on the outside of the tube, and Kellogg's will actually find it. Okay, six. Sticks the res there. Coldimenta will respond of over. Over towards B, we'll find Shazam. Nookie, look at this guy. He's just gone, guys, the entirety of the space is clear. I've got middle, I've got everything you need. Just keep focusing on that B side. He's taken all that space and controlled it. The three players from Sentinels now are essentially noted. Every single one of them is known where they're at. So now they're going to have to fight basically back to the wall out of this. Tens, how much space can you get them? Swing on it. Okay, that's not bad. Second down for taking down the front line. This is a problem. Call them into doing what he can. But now it's a 2v3. Any more Tens is still working forward. This man will put the weight of the world on his shoulders for his side, but there's a player close by. Sees Kellogg's, expects a swing from Mensa. He reads him so well. Tens is just going God mode. And now the 2v2, he's working out every single... Has he just read his position? Misread. But the timing, the timing is just off. Nookie remains. does him by a second, and there it is. Safety found. Shazam with that operator online now, Lauren. Ooh. Okay, next step, back and forth we go. Kellogg's had his out. Right back in it, Shaz. That brute force in it. Yeah, it looks like Pixel, though. Oh, he was not really ready for that. It was a bit of a, I guess, a lazy-ish clear on it. It outdone and then some in response. You can see all the olds coming down, and they actually both right connect down, in the end. Cold Amanda did find sick, even at the very last go of it, which actually gives the player advantage back over to G2. That will be oh, no. Cold Amanda and Nookie swing on the back of that owl drone. It's left to Zoms and Shazam here. Zoms would have wiped his pit of his own, but right here it's going to be difficult. I mean, he needs another kill in order to get that online, but the spike tucked just behind serving. There is. Gallows will find one there. Zoms will trade one out before HP. Just a matter of time. A Vova comes through. G2 put themselves two ahead here in the second half. They bounced back. They found that little bit of rhythm here, 10 to 8, as you said. This was the first couple they've strung to get off the back of the, an actual timeout where they were discussing what was happening. We, Looking after a lot of angles here. This can get incredibly dicey. Still looking for it. And they're now encroaching on the side. Spots one, can't find it, needs to back away. Spike coming down, we're in post-plant territory. Hello, Vati will respond with a blade storm of his own. Viper's bit invested on site here. Sentinel's looking to secure. Oh. Actually, Nookie wins what? a 1v1 with Dapper on the flank here. She's no! the problem. He's found a second, Lauren. Nookie just straight up clotheslined him. And now a 5v3. This retake looks like it's got legs, but 10 still stands, so I won't run him out just yet. And diving on in. Oh, out of nowhere. Stick just gets surprised. Just didn't expect Kellogg's. And now we're down to just 10s, and he's fallen. It's going to be 11 on the board. What a response from G2 again. Remaining composed, everything stacked against them in that round. The Vipers pit in some of these rounds. A wonky purchase here on the side of Sentinels. Tens on a Guardian, sick. And that Spectre. Kellogg's there, will open things up with the Operator though. Shazam falls. Kellogg's tries to dip back in again for a second. These peaks from Kellogg's man are dangerous. The Navy feeling himself. <laughs> You can see as to why. Just going to keep trying to be stylish on the 20 HP, and he's still going. That's three. And more One Beckham, but Cold has got his cross. He's got his buddy in arms, and Kellogg's finally falls. But the rest of G2 are right here as Dapper left amongst the bodies of his teammates. So few options. Mixwell watching the back. 
Cold Dementor, the first man forward. It's gonna be 12 now, one away from map three. It dipped away for a while. This could be the resurgence, and that's the start. Kellogg's already getting off to a cracking beginning. Nookie to follow. This is looking like they're about to put a bow on it for at least this map and get ready for that third. I can imagine a better way to see these two giants clash, but there's still Dapper sick and tens. But A is just looking closed for business. Absolutely mixed well again in the position. Tens will actually find a response. Of over though. They're in position. Look at that. Kellogg's with another three-piece to close things out. G2. Third